Hello everybody, welcome back to Mindsight Games. My name is Endsight, and today we are continuing part two, now, of Xenoblade Chronicles 2. If you're wondering why I'm back on the title screen, it's that after you start a save file, you will be gifted this beautiful looking opening. You'll have the option to continue, view events, go to the options menu, and change your options, yada yada yada. But, we're gonna go ahead and kick right off with the, with the game. Uh, and I do need to check something before we jump in. Good. I'm using the right file. And here we are. Ooh, hang on. Expansion pass. Nope, not yet. And we're definitely not there yet. Alright, so... Aside from the stuff we've already collected yesterday, technically yesterday being the same record, the second recording of this, um, we've got a couple of things we need to take care of. First off, we need to head up to the third floor and talk to, I believe it's Fishy Fishy, or it's the stall named, F yeah, Fishy Fishy with Kitoto. Welcome, friend. Now then, what should I buy? Buying... Oh boy. 30% off ether damage, 40%. There's a lot on this one. I'll get one of those. I'll, I'll get one of each. Thanks for custom. Big job preparations complete! The main story quest is finished. You bought supplies, food, and stocked up on food, so you're all ready to salvage. And I get a little bit of experience. Right, I've got the accessory I wanted, and I'm all sorted for food. I think that should just about do it. There's still time left before I have to leave, so maybe I'll rest up at the end. Could head back to Gramps to rest, but he might try to give me another lecture. So yeah, the end seems best. I have plenty of cash left, and it can't hurt for a nice, comfy bed once in a while. The inn should, the inn should be just past Rumble Tom Canteen. And as Rex put it, let's get moving. All right, so the inn's right over here. Let me quickly explain about lodgings. When you take a short rest, you can use any bonus bonus experience you've earned to boost your level. Bonus EXP is the experience you earn when competing the quest landmarks. Be sure to rest it in on occasion so you can use it. If you come up against a foe you just can't beat, do a few quests, build up your bonus XP, EXP, then go to a lodging facility and level up. On the other hand, if you're the type that likes a challenge, you're free to never level up at lodgings at all. It can be fun to live, li live dangerously. Anyway, you've got a big day if you ahead of you tomorrow, so you better get some shut-eye. Yes, I do, but I want to go past that because, oh... It's a level down. You know what? I'm gonna go accept those quests. I wanna go see what those quests are all about. So I'm gonna go accept them. And we've got a third quest over there. Huh. Or maybe that's just the... Yeah, that's just the first one that I'm looking for. Alright, aft. Hi there. Yo! We were just about to play hide and seek. If friend need anything, friend have to come later. Wait. Friend maybe look like friend want to play with us? Friend maybe look like friend want to play with us? Oh, that not occurred to me. Well, if you insist, it's okay. We can all play together. But you're seeking first. Leave it to me. Wow, you're eager. Okay, let me explain rules. Let me explain rules. Hiding area is anywhere on Goldmouth ground level. When we include higher floors, the game goes on for days and days. Then Model Pond get angry. Anyhow... We find when we find everyone, meet back in Bower Lounge. Bo Bower Lounge. Got it? Roger. Hiding area not big, but we very good at hiding. Friend, n friend, don't think it go easy. Yeah, we play hide and seek every day. We hi we'll hide like there's no tomorrow. Okay, we'll go hide now. So friend, count to a hundred before looking. Yes. Hide and seek received. And I want to set this as my active quest. All right, it's really early on in the in the game, so I do want to take care of these things. And it already has, it already has, like, itinerary items that I can work for. Okay. I see on my map, 
I've got exclamation marks. I think that's where they are. Am I going closer or farther away? Okay, I was going farther away from them. Uh, oh, Shun, I didn't talk to you. Hey, Rex, looks like you got quite the salvaging business going there. Been to Central Exchange yet? You should bring your haul along there. Collectible, treasure, whatever's in your pockets. You'll get a better deal if you sell them off in bulk. Playing the market in your favor is the market with true salvager. All right. Um. Meh, 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 meh. But sneak, sneaky, sneaky, sneaky. I didn't even figure that out for a second. Sneaky, sneaky is so nondescript. Usually hard find even when not aged properly. <laughs> Pretty impressive, right? Friend must have amazing observation power. Okay, sneaky, sneaky. Go ahead and wait in the Bower Lounge. Bower Lounge. Okay. Uh, I, oh, I see him on my map. I see him on my map. Where are ya? Where in the deck are ya? Uh, no? Not you. I wonder. Where are they? On the ground level, of course, but... Okay, hang on. Oh, this is another quest. Okay, I thought it was them. I thought it was one of them. Wait, 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 wait. That might be one up there. North. Okay. And... Hey, Aft! I see you. How do I get up to you, though? Oh, that's how you get up there. Okay. No! Is that not how I get there? Hey, Aft. Aw, oh, rats, you found me already! I was so sure I had the perfect hiding place as well. So lame. Uh-huh. Ah, uh, whatever. I'm glad you didn't take it easy on me. I'll go wait in the Bower Lounge. Cool! Alright, we got two out of three. Where's the third one? Uh... On this level... I'm going toward... I'm going clo I'm getting closer. He's on the outside. I got it. Alright. Razzly Dazzly! Oh my gosh, you have such a good name! Oh my gosh! Doing good, Rex? Our gentleman is as amazing as dreamed! Many people buzzy buzzy li live lives. But it's also slightly scary. Bumped into our Danian man earlier and, and he stares straight into soul. Razzly Dazzly hightailed it out of there, made, sh made enough distance between, between to make sure they're not followed. Maybe come in handy as reference if Rex need to escape from enemy. Thanks. Razzly Dazzly, I love you already, dude. I I'm taking a photo. I'm taking a photo. <laughs> I know you're in there. Fred, find me inside cask. Unfair! Talulu. Please excuse. Talulu is one who is unfair. After sneak, sneaky sneaky, never find Talulu here. Eyes and friend must be very strong. Nah, there was a big ol' exclamation point above your head. <laughs> Talulu was last? Okay, me go back of Bower Lounge now. Does it teleport us? No, it doesn't. Alright, and we gotta go back to them to finish the quest. Uh, Kynithia. Aren't Blades the coolest thing ever? They're all like, kapow, and use all those flashy weapons. They fight with the power of friendship. Yeah, kind of. Ch teamwork and friendship. When I grow up, I want to be a driver, too. Th uh, as well? Oh, okay. She's talking about how she wants to be a driver. Then I can even get my own blade, and we can be a team, and it'll be the best thing ever. All right, so Kenithia is actually enthusiastic. Another salvaging point over there. Now I'm just along the lines of I gotta salvage it. Oh my gosh, what the oh, hell? Okay, never mind. I'm battling you. I'm battling you, bub. He just fell... <laughs> he just fell off the side of the ship? That crab is the... That crab is just insane. That's amazing. Just watching it, watching him jump up and then just rush away. Alright. I may not have been able to take him out, but I'm taking Time you guys take down. You down. Yeah. 
Uh, do I change targets by pressing R or how do I change targets? There we go. Okay. Anchor shot. I'm do a little more damage there. Did I do that? Why not? Got him. I hope that wasn't part of a quest because I'm not going back to see. If okay. In the heat of battle, everything's about location, location, location. If you move around your opponent's blind spots, it'll be much easier for your attacks to connect. My old man practically drilled that into me. I used to be a merc. Don't... Oh, used to be a merc, don't you know? I really take after the guy, don't you? Don't you think? Well, actually, I guess you wouldn't know. <laughs> oh, you lose. Alright. Um... Sprain. His name is Sprain. Hey there, Rex. This Titan ship catch your interest? This is finest Titan ship uh, in all of the Argentum Trade Guild, after all. But as, but as you can see, it's currently undergoing maintenance. It won't be set in sail for a while yet. If you want to see it in action, try coming around another time. All right, Sprain. I'll check it out later. I still can't get o I still cannot get over the name Razzly Dazzly. That is probably my favorite name so far. And that's including characters we haven't met yet. And I I know, I know, we technically have met Nia already, but I mean met and will technically work with from here on out. Okay. Uh, da, 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 da. Where are they? One level up. And right here in the lounge. There's Aft. Hey, guys. Everyone here now? Been fine to Lulu already? Yes, friend is hide and seek genius. Here, here. Anywho, thank. Oh, anyhow, thank for playing. It's no problem at all. Meh. Aft, have to say thank you. Yeah, yeah, I was gonna. Thanks for playing. My parents are both too busy to play with me ever. But today was real fun. Really. Thanks a lot for playing with us. You can come play with us anytime. Roger. Uh, here's a thank you gift from Sneaky Sneaky and friends. I love the name Sneaky Sneaky. It like scrap of treasure for us. Ooh, or maybe it's just scrap. Anywho, please take. Thanks. All right then. Guess you got places to go. Come and play again. See you around. Ah, I like that group of boys. Hide and seek complete. Nice. I got some experience, some SP, and a muscle belt. Ooh, that's another accessory. All right, I'm gonna talk to Sneaky Sneaky. Hi there. Sneaky Sneaky not have much presence, so always end up hearing grown up say things Sneaky Sneaky not supposed to hear. Let's hear the details. Sneaky Sneaky give example. Attacks not just for dealing damage, sometimes they have additional effect as well. Unfortunately, Sneaky Sneaky have low, have low reading level for own age, so not exactly sure what that means. Well, I know what that means, and I'm gonna get into it later. Have you heard anything interesting? I'm not even looking at the knob on. Friends heard of Twinkle Juice? Tolulu love Twinkle Juice. And when Tolulu get to eat favorite food, Tolulu feel energy ch channeling through body. Friends should definitely take like lots of yummy snacks on adventure. But maybe not to overeat because could cause cavities and then get telling off of Mama Pond. Eh, uh, yeah, if I overeat my, and I get cavities, my mom chews me out too. Not in that so <laughs> I didn't even notice the pun there. Hi there. Just thought of something cool. Drivers of blades are always together, right? Doesn't that mean they can play hide and seek whenever they want? So I'm gonna I'm so gonna become a driver. Okay, we've heard about we've heard about drivers, we've seen three of them, I be, or two of them, I believe. We can't really count Jin in that number. Um, we've already been introduced to them. I'm not sure what the other guy's name was. Alright, I, I want to accept this other quest. Where? Oh. Quest is around here. He sold it. Bother, bother. Can't use Nop on his muscle. And I can't just ask the Ardanians. Is something wrong? Hm? Oh, hi. Well, actually, I got some cargo from the harbor that... It, that I brought from Uriah to trade, but it's an ever so slight nuisance. Uh, is anyone causing trouble? That's a good guess, except it's not exactly a person. It seems that Trent Crabbles love the stuff I'm transporting. To get to it, they clamber on deck and try to steal the cargo. I heard some goons to stand guard, but they got all done in. They all got done in, so I'm out here now looking for someone to replace him with. 
but I'm having no luck so far, so it's starting to feel a bit tired. Aww. Uh -huh. Like to help if that's okay. Saying you'll take the job. Thanks a bunch, pal. You're one in a million. The cargo's in Goldmouth Return Point. In return Port. It's pretty large and can't miss it. It'd be great if you could chase off the thieving Trent Crabbles. Thanks in advance. Leave it to me. Cargo export. Received. And I want to set this as my active quest. And it's going to be on this side, isn't it? Yep, right over here. I see it. Trent Crabbles. No, hey, buddy. I, lost the upper hand. I know, I lost the upper hand. Yeah. Yeah. And doop. Slice. Yeah. Slice. And stab. Alright, anchor shot. I want your potion. Heals me up. And there we go. Oh, there's another one. Alright. Okay. I'm waiting for that anchor shot to pop up. There we go. I probably should move. I probably should move my Wi Fi router. It's obscuring my view of the TV. <laughs> it. The, the little antenna on part of my Wi Fi router is covering up the. Oh, no, no, no! Get that! Get that! Get that! Thank you! Okay, good- goodness gracious, I almost lost that. Oh, that is close to the edge. I do like the musical right- No! You jerk! Oh gosh, no! No! Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, I can't get back up! I can't get back up! I have to swim through. I, I discovered this on my own. I, I went onto my other profile and played up to at least the point where we had put. And you guys are gonna be jerks about this. All right. Oh hey, I got Sword Bash. I guess that's my level three art that I can use. Okay. I'm gonna try using Sword Bash. And that HP potion just went into the water. Petra crushed it. And because of that, all my money went into the water. Well, I don't think the Trent Crabbles are going to come back anytime soon. Let's let Isolde know. That being said, that was a jerk move, Crabble. That was a jerk move. You made me lose all the stuff that you dro like, I dropped my HP potion, I lost all the gold that you dropped. You were a jerk. <laughs> Alright. Uh, let's go turn in the quest. Uh, here you are, Isolde. I'm back. Thank you. Thanks to you chasing off the Trent Crabbles, I was able to make my delivery. I'm really grateful to you. No problem at all. I'd feel better if someone tough like yourself could guard my wares, but, eh. Sorry, but no. You know, if those Trent Crabbles come snooping again, I'll try hiring some mercenaries from Garfont. Right, they say those mercs are as buff as buff can be. But I digress. Here's your reward for protecting my wares. Please take it. Thanks. And we get... Well, we get the quest completed. Cargo escort complete. Well, it was more like Crabble... <laughs> Crabble... Crabble Rabble. With the Crabbles gone, a soul day's trade deal went off without a hitch. In future, she plans to hire mercenary guards. Shell Cameo. SP, gold, and some experience. Nice. Alright, I'm gonna head up this way. Uh, development level 1. Nice. I believe it's affinity. I believe it's called development in this game, but it's more like affinity rather than development in the original Xenoblade. Uh, let's go ahead and go up this way and head to the guild. I have no other quests I want to do. I want to advance the story. Uh, short rest. 90G. And what's my timer at? Hang on. Uh, oh, I'm only 19 minutes in. I can keep going. Can level up? Yes, I can! I can go to level 5. Oh. Yeah, I'll go to level 5. Yeah, I'm feeling stronger than before. Alright, so I'm level 5 now. Finished leveling up. We're good to go! Pretty cool! 
is really so different from this. This is really so different from sleeping in that little hut on Krampus' back. For some reason, I feel like I've got a bit stronger. Anyway, but I have to meet a point. Gold mouth exit dock down on the ground floor, right? Guess there's still a little time to linger, look around Gold Mouth a bit longer if I want to, but I shouldn't all along. All right, well. That being said, a number of shops are now available for you to use. You'll find a whole range of different traders as you journey across all rest. Our Tintum Trade Guild is known as the hub of all rest commerce, so naturally you'll find a plethora of different shops here. While you're here, you should make sure you've got everything you need before you head out on your adventures. Let's do this! Double spinning edge uh, obtained. Oh, forgot to tell you something about Pet Rex's pouch. Rex never goes anywhere without his handy pouch. Great for putting his favorite items inside, so he always has them close to hand. It's not that... It's not that big, it can just hold one handy item at a time. So, what should you put in your pouch? Well, usually the sort of everyday items you find at lifestyle socks shops. Just keeping them close by can have all sorts of effects. There are 12 different types of lifestyle shops across all Rex, so if you encounter a new one, be sure to check it out. Cool! What, 12 types? Not 12 actual shops. Okay. Alright, let's go to the expansion pass. We got a useful pouch item sample, thank you very much, and we're not going to get that core crystal set until we actually get a good blade. Let's go to Rex. I want to check your pouch. What do I want to put in here? Um, I'll thank your tail. Braised Cloud Sea Shark. Um, this one is minus 50 ether damage, minus 50 minus 5% ether damage taken and physical damage taken. That's better than that one for a little bit. And I'm not really at the point where that works. Um, uh, let's put this in the pouch. Okay. And I actually want to check the contents. Yeah, I'll leave it there. 20 minutes, though. That's the thing. It's 20 minutes. I may want to save those for later. Oh, no! I'm going to take damage. That was a quarter of my... That was a third of my health bar. A core store. No point in stopping here unless you're a driver. I'm not a driver. At all. Shinini has accessories. Den... Den Den? His products here aren't, so, aren't of use to salvagers. Only useful maybe for a driver or a blade. See if you've got anything else. You got a muscle belt, but I have that. A shell cameo, but I have that. An attack stone. Okay. Increases HP restored to self, not using health potions by 10%. Oh. Okay. Um. Increases HP restored when receiving when reviving a teammate by 25%. Okay. Increases auto attack damage by 20%. Increases ether by 20 and strength by 20. I want to. I want to equip that muscle belt I have, so I'm going to go ahead and jump in. Uh, let's go to accessories. Slot 2. I want the muscle belts. Thank you. Um, enhance arts. Uh, I have... How many skill points do I have? Oh, I've got 232. Okay. Um, I could up... Spin, double spinning edge or sword bash. I'm gonna up sword bash then. Uh, yeah, let's do that. It's gonna be a back attack. Backslash! <laughs> it's a broadsword style move. Alright. Let's back out of here. Uh, Zuzu. What do you have? Definitely have. Oh, okay. I don't have access to that. Bon Bon! Let's check you out. Recharges arts by 0.4 each second. Ooh. Oh, that looks glorious. It's really expensive, though, compared to the other stuff. So there's that. Um, sparkle sugar. Recharges arts by 0.3 each second. Synopon roll. We heard about this before. Recharges arts by 0.2 each second. Melodious melon parfait, essentially 0.1 each second. Oh, man. Uh, you know what? Despite my better judgment, I'm gonna buy one of these and a Sparkle Sugar. But I'm not gonna equip either of them. I'm not gonna put either of them in the pouch. Um, where do I need to go? Back deck. 
far ship in the corner right here, right? Wheeling out the maelstrom for this, Banner sure has deep pockets. Gawking at a boat. What are you, twelve? Wait, maybe you are twelve. What's my age got to do with anything? I can tell an awesome feat of engineering when I see one. You don't close your mouth soon, you're gonna swallow a fly. What's her problem? We're nearly the same age. Also, you might want to watch where you stand. Otherwise, when we cast off, that rope will take your leg off. Gotcha. What, you little? Now look whose mouth's hanging open. Rex, we're heading out. There's no one seeing you off, right? You got night watch. Till then, rest up inside. Aye, aye. Later. <laughs> that girl apparently does not like us. Before you head off on your big job, I'd like to explain some- Okay, a little something about selling items and all the rest. May have already made some use of them, not really, but there are some business businesses called item trading shops, and my cord is messing with me. All right, hang on. There we go. I moved my mic to my other side so the computer wouldn't make, uh, wouldn't make blowing noises into the microphone, but that's a whole nother thing entirely. If you sell off items as a whole set, you'll learn a bunch more money than if you sold them off individually. So when you find precious treasures, shop, precious treasures, don't just sell them off the cheap at a regular shop. See if you can put together sets for trading shops and make a tiny profit. Huh. Alright. Before I talk to Sprain, I don't want to sprain mine. Okay, that was a bad pun. I'm sorry. I'm not Chugga Conroy. I'm gonna adore the game for what it is. But there are a lot of good puns here. There are a lot of good puns here. Um, what are you? What is this? Oh, it's another favorite item. Okay. Tradeway King 66 plus 20% blade arts effect. Ah, it's so expensive. You know what? I'm gonna buy the Sneaky Thief King and the Tradeway 66. Alright, I think we're good. Not on chess set looks pretty cool. Alright, I need to stop I need to stop looking at at shops, because otherwise I'm gonna be buying everything. Now here's the thing. I'm a guy who likes to collect everything. I like collecting things, finding things, buying things in that sense. And not just not just in real life, I mean in games. Let's go to Sprain. See what you got. Never thought I'd see the day you'd be riding the Maelstrom, Rex. Suppose, suppose it just goes to show how far you've come as a salvager, eh? Well, I'm proud of you, lad. Now, are you all set? We're gonna set and sail as soon as you're ready to board. Yes, I am. That's what I like to hear. Come on, then. Hop on. We're, head we're heading into uncharted territory for this job, you know. I'm getting goose pimples just thinking about it. CSEV Maelstrom. We should be reaching the uncharted t zone tomorrow, but there's plenty of time left until then. Guess I could go and talk with the clients for a bit. I still don't know as much about them as I'd like to. Besides, not every day you get to talk to real drivers. Oh, and once I'm done with them, I'd better go see Monel. I'm meant to be on lookout duty tonight. He won't be very pleased if I never show up. I'm gonna take a little bit of time to talk to the people on the ship, but, uh, ooh. Okay, so talk to Spraying real quick. Be on well, so I just do what you do. Love to, but sort of have guard duty. Aw, oh, that's too bad. Well, make sure you go guard like no one's ever guarded before. Even mindless tasks like that are part of the life's lesson for everyone. Life's little lesson. When okay. did it get so late? Alright, I want to talk to Poop... Uh... Poopunin. Poop Poopanin or Pooponin? I don't know how to say it. 
What are you doing? I mean, what are you doing here? Meh meh. Poopooning is, uh, taking vacation. Just, yes, just going on a little pleasure trip. Hmm. That's a little suspicious. Kind of. Alright. NPCs will move around depending upon where we are, so I'm not too worried about that. Alright, so here's Jin. Hi there. Hmm. You're from Latheria, are you? Sure am. I was raised in Fonset Village. The village is right by cloud sea, the cloud sea, so I grew up swimming in the clouds. That's why salvaging work comes natural in me. I'm pretty confident in my skills, despite how I may look. Very good. I don't want to give him a voice before I hear it, because I did not get a good chance to hear it the first time we saw that cutscene. I certainly right. won't have to sec- Oh, here. Uh, I want to see Sever real quick. <laughs> Evading Mellow's attack when you're not even a driver. That's impressive, boy. I look forward to seeing how you handle the work ahead. Is that a compliment? Thanks, I think. But <laughs> I'm sorry. Just in the background, I saw... Okay. Okay, I, I don't know where it came from, but... Alright, where is it? I think... Where is it coming from? I saw it. yeah, booze. I want booze coming out of rain. Oh, it's below. It's below us in the bot in the second deck. Rex, you not go see Monel and take over lookout duty yet? Monel is on platform just above here. Steps a bit rickety, so careful not to fall off. All right, Razzly Dazzly. I can tell I'm probably gonna see you a little bit booze. <laughs> the booze. <laughs> what do you want, kid? I'm cold, Rex. Actually. Pleasure, work, pleasure to be working with you. So I'm guessing you're not going to fill me in on exactly what it is we're looking at here? That's the idea. Need to know basis. Why, are you curious? Well, sure I am, but I'll do the work I'm paid for whether you tell me or not. That's what I like to hear, kid. Just hope your skills are more advanced than your age. Name's still Rex, not kid. Wow. Rex, you make him sound like a jerk. Hey, Rex, you're taking a- Oh, Come on, watch, yeah? Look out, tech. All right. Is it over here? Where was it? It was a disembodied voice that said, Booze, I want booze. I want to see where that was. Oh, boy. Am I supposed to be able to get up there? No. That is literally just a crane. All right. I want to talk to Nia before I talk to Dromark. Seem awfully quiet. Did you get seasick or something? Of course I'm not seasick. I'm just not used to the ships with this many salvagers on it's all. Well, if it's wearing you out, you'll be a wreck by the time we reach our destination. I can handle myself, all right? Okay, jeez. Wanna, wanna whine about it. Oh, draw mark, right. Master Rex, are you prepared to begin salvaging? Let us all work well together to make this mission a success. Wouldn't have it any other way. I really like Draw Mark. Look at him! Majestic white lionoid cat. That is beautiful. He's like a cross between a lion, a leopard, and a, a lion and a snow leopard. That is beautiful. Oh man. And he's got he's got freaking black and blue lit armor on top of that. That is a cool looking design. Kinda wish he was my blade. I'm no driver yet. Alright, let's go up here. Where about Oh! All the way up here. Hey, Monel! So you finally arrived, have you? Well, are you here to keep watch or aren't you? Start the shift! Ah, at last, I can get a breather. I think I've earned myself a drink or two. It's not looking too good out there. I'd steal yourself for the worst. If something's up, give me a shout. Don't worry, I'll be I won't be drinking myself. It just, ooh, excuse me, into a stupor or anything. All right, I'll keep my eye out. Hmm. That's the black ship from the harbor. Is it following us? Oof, it's way too cold up here. You? 
I'll have you know I've got a name. It's Mia. They've started boozing below decks. You should join them. Why aren't you there? It's not that I hate it. I just really don't need a headache right now. Huh. Good thing you're not a salvager then. Why's that? Swim like a fish and drink like one too. That's the salvager's code. Pff, sounds terrible. I don't think I'll be changing careers. Hmm, probably for the best. Anyway, I bet you drivers earn a hell of a lot more than salvagers do. So, kid? My name's Rex. Okay, Rex. Why did you start salvaging in the first place? That there. The world tree? I don't get it. You know, you find all sorts of things digging through salvage. Some of it trash. Some of it treasure. But all of it from people long gone. Have you noticed, though, there's fewer titans each day? I saw one go under just the other day. It was a pretty big one. There must have been loads of animals still living on it. Living space is running out. Day by day. And sooner or later, we'll be the ones sinking down into the cloud sea. But up there, Elysium is waiting for us. <laughs> Seriously, kid? Elysium? Don't tell me you believe that gaff. So that's, uh, why you're a salvager? It's just a lie for children. And that there is just an overgrown shrub. If there's a way to get up there, maybe it's hidden below the clouds. Is it really that crazy? Seriously, though? There'd be no need to fight over dwindling land and resources. No need to worry about our homes sinking away. Everyone could have peace and security. I mean, a dream like that, isn't that worth believing in? Nobody can tell you what to believe, but... <clears throat> Everyone, huh? What? I always thought people were pretty selfish by nature, but you... Huh. Do you have parents? No. When I asked Gramps, he told me they died when I was just a kid. Gramps? Oh, the same one who taught you to use arts. Yeah. He basically raised me himself. He's not like us, though. Not like... I'm not sure I catch a drift. But this Gramps of yours sounds all right. Huh. And you're all right too, kid. Not that different from me. We're in position. All personnel, report to stations. Salvage team, suit up and proceed to hatch. Well, looks like we're heading to the salvage area. I want to grab Poopanine one more time. Meh meh? Never mind. Rec never Rex mind about Poopanine. What happened to salvaging? Chairman, expect results. Oh, don't worry. I'll be working very hard, especially when there's a hundred thousand gold on mine. That the spirit? Now quick, quick, hurry downstairs and head to the Romney viewpoint. Is there another NPC? Razzly Dazzly. This is not right way to place a meetup. Hurry to flow the floor. If not, hurry, boss get mad. Got it. Your target is located inside a shipwreck 450 pairs straight down. Searching the wreck while submerged is too high risk for our tests, so we'll be using flotation devices and cranes to lift the hull first. Next, you'll split into teams and explore the interior. Once the target is found, retrieval can commence. If that's clear, let's begin with attaching the floats. Get into position. We're paying you low lives a lot, so don't screw it up! You smug so-and-so.
and submerge. Is that it? It looks pretty ancient. Is that the... propulsion mechanism? I've never seen one that shape before. Which country made this? That's massive. The appearance matches our reports, but it's what's inside that matters. Object is secure. Proceed to second phase. Excellent work. You're not half bad, you know that. I do this for a living, remember? All teams, proceed. Inside when ready. Right then. Let's get moving. You with us. Me? You're gonna drag the kid along. Seriously? Guess he thinks you need all the help you can get. Oh yeah. <laughs> There, you've got your orders, haven't you? Party information that's changed. Interesting. All right. Uh, well, Rex is locked into that slot, no doubt. Um, I don't trust you. All right. I think we're good with this. Um, let's just go for it. You just acquired new comrades! Main menu, characters change order to change them up. You can only take three at a time into battle, so choose carefully. Number the character set to number one will be the character that you control. No two characters fight in exactly the same way, so shoot experiment with a few to find who suits your best playstyle. All right, I want to talk to Monel. There's no telling what you'll find under in an undiscovered region. Best to remain vigilant. Got it. Still, you'll have a, you'll be with a bunch of drivers. Drivers have incredible strength, so you'll probably be fine with them. You just concentrate on fulfilling your role in the mission. All right, um, how did I think about it? Oh, it doesn't look like I'm able to substitute Rex in at all. Okay, hang on. Nope, I, I know I won't be able to grab that. Okay. Let 
me show you what a driver can do. Yeah. Oh, time to shine. Lethal Lysat King. Okay, I'm gonna go to the back. I don't have the aggro now, so I should be fine. Back attack. Do that. Not bad. Pretty well. Amazing. So that's how drivers and blades fight. So ruthless. It's like they're monsters themselves. Nice. I'm sure glad these drivers are on our side. You too, Dromark. No need to get hysterical, it was a walk in the park. Yeah, but still. That's enough yapping, you pair of brats. Let's move! Kuh. Talk about self-important. Gramps always taught me to respect my elders. Elders. <laughs> <laughs> They make short work of monster. These no ordinary fighters. Big job in Moradain going well too. There much money to be made from these people. <laughs> All right. I don't know why Malice is kind of unsettling. Nia's starting to grow on me. I do like that though. Um, I do want to point out, well, there you are. The two drivers that we have alongside Rex, uh, their blades will also follow them in combat. So it's, we're in the real world outside. Time to let you lure. Um, press down for battle. Huh, okay. Just so. Gotcha. Okay. Time to take you down. I can take care of myself. All right. You got the aggro. I'm waiting for that sword dash to fill up. Probably won't be able to get a sword bash in. Anchor shot. Eh, anchor shot. Oh well. Okay. Uh, I don't want to go down. I want to check up here. See if there's any. I like exploring, alright? This is the one time we're gonna get- oh boy. But- Okay. Fine. Treasure acquired. Alright. Not bad. Okay. Time to take you down. Stay in your toes. Ooh, new track. That's pretty good. A Rancor Crabble. We can do this all day. It was a meaningless guy. victory. Let's show him a thing or three. I'll do as I please. <laughs> I'm glad that they that they give us a chance to use Malos here. You're not you're not just given you're not just giving me uh you're not just giving Malos. You're giving so Malice, Jin, Mia, the three who hired you for this job. So you're still Rex I in this sense. For a while, of course, my lady. That Can I... I am here for. Go to characters. Can I change the order here? Nope. Can't change the order of characters. I'm gonna keep do... I'm gonna keep checking in. Actually, no. I think I'll hold off until we get, like, to a good point. I found there'll probably be, uh, found there'll probably something. be a, ooh. Oh my goodness. There's five enemies down there. Maybe six. There's a set, there's a fifth, it's sixth or seventh over here. I actually uh, want. Uh, Can I? 
There we go. Alright. It's R and B in order to stop locking onto them. Okay. Give me this. And I want to go ahead and attack you! Let's see what you got, kid. Come on! Alright, there we go! Pretty good. Uh, I'm wondering. Yeah, I'm gonna drop off here. I'm... You know what? Yeah! I'm gonna get stuck in. Okay, time to take you Go right into the fight. Oh, I didn't even get a chance to use my arts there. Okay. Um, the reason I want to keep battling everybody is I want the experience at so at one point or another. And my, like anybody in my party is going to help out with that. Oh, that's the XP bar. Okay, so the experience bar is that yellow bar. That's cool. Okay, time to take Bubble Medus. All right, I'm to his backside. One more, and I can use. Yep, there we go. Take them all out. Oh, not a king crust tip. Okay. All right, fine. Time to take you down. I'll do yeah. as I please. Yeah. Don't go to the same side I am. I'm gonna use double spin, split, yeah. double spinning edge. Right yeah. You're in the way, dude. Okay, double spinning edge. Side attack plus. Moving around. Not bad. That landed right on Nia. That landed right on Nia. That was a pretty good time. And that was a pretty good angle. Let's keep moving. All right. Are there any other? Oh gosh. Um, I technically. Oh gosh, I didn't have a chance. I didn't have a chance to contemplate anything. Okay. What was Nia doing in the background? I didn't get a chance to see what art she was doing, so. Alright, fine. Everyone's getting psyched. A lethal like that. We had uh the boss of these a little while ago. Shell bash. So the arts they're using pop up on screen too. That's very helpful. A lot more helpful than Xenoblade Chronicles. And if you're wondering, yeah, Xenoblade Chronicles, when I played that game, had a few things that, like, confused me, so I didn't get a chance to, like, understand everything immediately out of the gate. And it was kind of hard to keep up, to keep track of... Ooh. Is there a way up there? Please tell me there's a way up there. No! I can't get up there! Ugh. Ah, there's no there's no sprint button either, so I can't jump and sprint over. Uh what can I do to get up there? I I'm thinking. Sorry guys, this may take me a second, but I really wanna to Ooh. So Oh, right there. That's how. Treasure Got it. Quiet. Nice work, genius! Ah, you figured okay. it out on your own! Oh, gods, come on! Not another lethal life set. Alright, fine. I mean, I'll battle the ones that attack me, but I kinda wanna go without any battles from here on out. 
There we go. Work, Meso. Malux. Why do I keep thinking Meso? <laughs> Mentally, I'm like, that's not how you spell his name. It has an M, an A, an O, and an S, but I didn't remember what it was. I was like, Meso? no. Malux. Alright. Definitely intriguing that we already know their names and we're not even like a quarter. Oh god! Okay. Bring it on. Dockle? Pagul. I gotta say, yeah, I do, I'm digging the music of this area. The, uh. The fighting music in this area, specifically. Not bad. Not bad at all. Alright. We're in the loading bay. What's over this way? Hey! You're all mine. Fuel tank 2. I think this is the way I was supposed to go, right? Please tell me this is the way I was supposed to go. Yeah, it's this way. Alright, I don't want to go there just yet. I don't want to go there just yet. I want to check this area. There's your treasure trove back that way. Thank you very much. Oh, no! And I can't do that. Great. We got enemies all over the place. All right, as soon as I get the chance to do anchor shot, I'm doing it. Anchor shot, we got... There we go. Whoa! That was a cool looking move there, Malice. Did I get inflicted with slow or something? My movement, it felt like my movement was slightly lower. I don't know if that was just me or like I'm slower in combat, but. Alright, fine. You wanna fight? Let's fight. I'm coming for my treasure. I want my gold. I want my awesome stuff. Art acquired Gemini loop and spiral sub Sava. Treasure Sava. acquired. Okay, nice. Savvy. Okay. <laughs> um, there's got to be another way down. This side, right? Treasure trove. Oh boy. How do I get in there? Oh, I gotta go down and out the other side. Okay. And arrived. System control room. What are we looking for? Either fuel chamber. Probably won't work with fuel. Oh wait, it would probably work with fuel. That's all I that's all I can do with that. Okay, bring it on. Oh no, come on. Alright, fine. It's like, I, I want to explore the ship, and I want to do it quickly. I'm already at, like, the, the 59 minute mark on this episode. <laughs> Alright, I think I'm going to end it here in a little bit. Let's finish off this lethal like that. Nice work. Thanks. Alright, I think that'll be it. Thank you all so much for tuning back into my... Oh, I'm going to get out of the way of this guy. Thank you all so much for... Tu Good. Thank you all so much for tuning back into Mindsight Games. My name is Insight, and next time on Xenoblade Chronicles 2, we're going to be going up that shaft and picking up that treasure and going and getting whatever's in here. I'll see you guys then.